and Shira here. Pesach is coming in just another 11 days or so, but who's counting? Today's my first day of my Pesach vacation. It's about a um, three and a half week vacation. Not too bad. It's a relief. Um, I know I just had like a mini vacation before the semester started, but this semester it has been insane. The days in school are so long, I just don't have time to keep up with the work and I think this vacation will give me a good opportunity, a good chance to catch up with everything. My goal for Pesach vacation, obviously aside from keeping one day of Yom Tif and spending time with my aunt and uncle and cousins from Toronto and some of my friends who are still here and doing all sorts of fun to and stuff, I'm going to try, keyword being tried, to take advantage of all this time I have off to catch up on all my notes, finish my two papers, and maybe start studying for the exams. Yeah, that's idealistic. It's come to my attention that I haven't really given you a school update recently to let you know how the semester has been going so far. Basically, it's okay, it's good. I like the semester a lot. I have a lot of really good classes. If you remember my last semester, it was basically anatomy, physiology, four days a week. Um, now, it's just a whole different arrangement of classes. I have a lot of stuff, you know, the science-y stuff, like immunology, genetics, physiology, fluids and electrolytes, you know, you have the science-y courses like that, then you have all the arts courses that are annoying, but you have no choice because you need it for the BSc, like sociology and research methods. The practical stuff is good, like learning how to do physical examination and different skills in nursing. It's a good break from all the hours we're sitting in class, which are a lot. Um, the hardest part about the semester really is the amount of in-class hours. Like, I'm in school from 8.30 to 4.30, five days a week, and it's really mentally exhausting. By the time I get home from school, I don't have any energy to, like, clarify my notes, read them over like I did in first semester. I have a couple of favorite classes. Um, I really like health and nutrition. It's a class, actually, that's one of our only non-mandatory classes, and it turns out most girls don't go to this class because I think they don't want to hear this stuff. But I really like it. It's a very good class. The teacher's good. I also like fluids and electrolytes. Classes are based on this book that's written in English. And it's just so interesting how, you know, just because it's of this one ion and the body is off, this one disruption in balance. It starts out this whole wave of body slow, slowly shutting down. To put it simply, I like the science classes because, you know, that's me. I like, I like science. But then the artsy classes, I mean, not artsy, but, you know, psychology-based stuff like sociology and research methods, you know. Not such a fan. And it's not the teacher's fault that their courses are, are just boring. We found out that the nursing students in second year do not have to do Midrashah next year. I know that one of the reasons why I came to Mechon Tal was because I wanted to do Midrashah, but like, but when it's mandatory and it's at 8.30 in the morning, when you have classes until 4.30 and sometimes even 5.30 and costs over a thousand shekel for the year, you kind of start not liking it so much. I think it would be great to have off an hour and a half in the morning, you know, where I can catch up on homework and if I want to go to a Kodesh class, it'll be more, you know, lishma, you know, the way I like it. On another note, back to Pesach, um, it turns out that most of my single English speaking friends are, in fact, going over Pesach. So I'm kind of, I don't know, feeling a little bit, I don't know, upset, I guess, that I decided to stay. Yeah, that was a question mark at the end of that sentence. I'm not sure because on the bright side, like the, the weather started to get beautiful and everything's, the whole country started to get re ready for Pesach. I have my aunts and my uncles and my cousins here and I have a few friends staying and you know, I have where to be and I have things to do. But I don't know that just knowing that all my friends are going back and they're going to get to like, you know, be at home with their families, it's a little bit, I don't know, a little bit of mixed feelings right now. I guess that's it for this week and yeah, I'll see you next week.